finally, we've got uh, Nathalie Payne here from Sail Dojo. Um, I just want to introduce my sponsored athlete. Um, I'm going to hand it over to Nathalie um, to explain who she is, what she's done, her achievements so far. Um, so over to you, Nathalie. Uh, my name is Nathalie Payne. I am currently 23 years old and compete for the England karate team. Um, I'm ranked number one in England at the minute for female kata. Um, I'm currently British, English and hopefully British international champion this year as I was last year. Um, I am within the top 100 in the world and hopefully trying to get to the Olympics, if not 2020, hopefully 2024. Um, and I'm currently just starting a new job as a PT. Perfect. Okay, so with your training routine, um, prior to a competition, how many hours a week do you kind of spend training? I know you spend a lot of time down at the dojo yeah. um, all the time and you have quite frequent massages, but if you were leading up to a competition, how many would you suggest that you um, have? Well, my training is probably like twice a day, one gym, one karate session or one run. Um, so obviously like your muscles are taking quite a lot of impact every day. So I'd say like at least like three or four leading up to competition and obviously at the um, British Championships we had a bit of a dilemma when I was cramping up in mid-comp so sometimes massages are done mid-comp and then post-comp we also probably do three or four afterwards as well. Perfect. Um, do you use any products or supplements um, to help your training, um, you know, your meals? What do you do? What's your kind of routine? Yeah, so my sponsor supplies me with Herbalife. So um, mostly I use probably recovery shakes. Um, sometimes we have like different teas, um, protein bars, um, but they're all supplied by Herbalife. Fabulous. Okay. Um, big question here, where do you see yourself in the future, Natalie? Well, I am getting on a little bit now, so I'm like 23 years old. It might not seem too old, but as an athlete it is, you are getting on a little bit. So um, I still want to compete for England probably for the next two years. Um, and I want to get an individual medal for England. That's my main goal. Probably not Olympics is my main goal because at this age now, the younger ones are pipping on your toes a little bit. Um, I obviously want to be a qualified PT helping everybody, but I also want to be a high level coach in a good few years time. Um, hopefully maybe like coaching for England or like regional and maybe opening my own club. So and that's where I'd like to be. coming up as well, yeah. behind you. So yeah, you she's pipping my that? toes. Um, I would like to coach Ellie in the future. Um, I think she's got a lot of potential to go to the Olympics or even Youth Olympics. So um, yeah, when she's 16, maybe that's when I'll retire when she's coming up into my category. But uh, yeah, no, it would be really nice to coach Ellie into success because I'm sure she'll have a lot. Okay, and what about your kata? What's your best favourite ultimate kata? That's a tough question <laughs> because there's a tough question, but probably Papa M because that's the one that's got me through some really sticky rounds, okay. um, ones that I've probably beat my main rivals with. So I'd I'd have to go with that one. It might not be. It's probably my favourite to train as well, but it's not the, the highest rank cutter or anything like that. It's probably one that's just got me through the most. Okay. Um, right, that's brilliant. I mean, you've got a lot, a lot of uh, followers on Instagram, um, Twitter, and your Facebook. So it's really, really good to see you uh, progress through the ranks and everything. Um, I think we've got, you know, with your sister up and coming as well, just yeah. behind you, which we're going to interview shortly. Um, I think you're doing very, very well, and I'm a, I'm proud to sponsor you. Thank you, you thank you for sponsoring me. Nutrition and obviously you're getting the right massages. Um, so thank you very much for coming in. Nathalie. Thank you.